Greetings and salutations, I'm Ken. Welcome back to this let's play of City Skylines. You know what, let's switch radio stations. I'm feeling like classical. I don't feel quite so upbeat at the moment. There we go, and let's make a narrow escape here. Come on, there we go. Oh yeah, you're gonna give me that kind of complaints, aren't you? Arg. Um. Well, you can't build the exit there because there's a there's a rail coming out there. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, there is a rail bridge there. I know. Uh, there's there's a pity I can't have a walkway on top of this ledge. Would have been so much better, rather than having to blow up everything. Or a wee footpath. Uh, can I build a footpath under that pillar? No, of course not. Can I guess a little on the other side. Now to rezone. Anything that was unzoned. Um, is this part of any district? It is the gener generic district. And it's close enough to the cargo terminal that it's probably best to make it industry. Wait a second. Oh, right, because these are part of the underpass thing there. Okay, then never mind. That's why I couldn't build there. Uh, this is part of the forest district, yes. Okay. I guess we'll build up here as well. Nice little dead end. Yeah, it is a dead end, isn't it? Um... Do I have an, another dead end over here? I'm toying with the idea of connecting this one to that. Question is though, how the heck are we gonna do that? Because you can't go up. That's gonna create one heck of a... That, that would be one heck of a switchback road. And it would level in this entire area. And going below isn't really an option either. since we have excavated this entire area. And then we have the other problem of building a massive switchback. Down. It is perhaps feasible though. Um, what is going on here? You're complaining about... too few services. Yeah, I know. For the most part that's probably going to be the park service. Since we haven't done much in terms of those. Better start building some greenery. Preferably on top of these open areas. Because now at least I know that there aren't going to be uh, any bus stations or train terminals on this side. Oh yeah, the train... Oh, the, yeah. He said just as he plopped down a park in the way of the train. Arg. Okay, you're gonna move. You have to move because we don't have a train track exiting from that station. Yeah, 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 I know. You're gonna get... But you're gonna get something in return. Just give me a moment. I need to just create this train track before I forget. Um, two options I could go down. Try to. I would not succeed though. So I have to go above this road at the very least. Then I can go down, if need be. This one's gonna connect over the mountain and off to the other area there. I think. Um, yeah, cargo terminal here. Another one over there somewhere. Somewhere down there. 
let's see. Now there's an ore pit over here. Lots of ore. So we're definitely in the cargo terminal over here. And all this farming area would probably benefit from a cargo terminal somewhere in the center here. And of course we're gonna need something in the southern area. But are we gonna need a rail that goes directly from here down there? I don't think so. We're gonna go, go straight over to the hilltop. So, where was that little uh, tapering railroad we just built? Arg, why must thing be, things be dark? There it is. I could build it straight over here as an elevated one. Nothing that stops me. Or I could uh, go below ground. Keep it out of harm's way, so to speak. I missed it again, didn't I? There we go. Yeah, I think we're gonna go below ground since we have the room for it here. There we go, and I connect onwards from here, somewhere. I have to dig dip down below the highway system, that's fine, and we can exit and do something over there. Eventually. It's now safely on the ground, so... That means I am free to build park stopside. With five squares. That's gonna be ideal while the playground there might be. Foolish. Dog park. Except I built the path on this side. Dang it. Other side then. A large playground is how large? Very large. Right, let's build one there. And I need more park areas up here. Park with trees, that's a monster one. Small park is probably better if I can squeeze it in here somewhere. Uh, it's gonna ruin the ones in the south there. Still. Let's wait for the graphics to catch up. So we can better see. Can I fit a large park here? Dang it, no! Ooh, what about the other side? No. It is simply too large. Can build one over here though. Put one of those. I haven't built many plazas either. Yeah, maybe sometime. Maybe sometime. Um other parks. A basketball court. Tourism and leisure. Yeah, we haven't done much of that at all. Yeah, our coasts are kind of busy. Riding range sounds kind of cool. Except it is massive. My goodness. Yeah, we're gonna have trouble fitting that in. <laughs> that might might be feasible to squeeze in over here on the highway lid. Yes, excellent. If I can just kind of taper it in, there we go. Excellent. 
and I want a skateboard park somewhere. Should probably be somewhere more urban. Maybe over here if I can find a good location for it. Quite urban, but I'll go with that. The woodland areas. Fine, so these guys also want some parks. Uh, what's the last one? Oh, yeah, the modder packs. Ooh. That sounds like something you want in the farming area, right? Uh, don't we have a footpath here? Did I not build a footpath? I didn't! Hmm, what an oversight. I'm sorry people, but we need our sidewalks. Oh, did I just build them some terrain in there? <laughs> did, didn't I? Uh, gonna be blown away anyway, so... Oops. Yeah, I did build quite a few of these roundabouts custom, so I probably missed some uh, footpaths. I know I don't have them here because that's, that's deliberate, given the on-way, uh, on-ramp situation. I need to inspect all these roundabouts. Are they properly designed? With sidewalks. This one is... Yes, okay, that's fine. It looks like that was the only one that missed the sidewalk needed. At least for now. Turn it back to the whole vertical farm thing. Big as hell. Yeah, I want it. I want to see what happens. Still not enough to make these guys happy. <laughs> Still, lovely little ver vertical farm. Right, right there on the riverside. In the farming commune. You are requiring more citizens slots. Um, fine. You know what? Let's build up down to the river. Densify up. Probably are gonna need someone to live up here as well. Okay, this road should, by the looks of it, go up below, provided, of course, we can. Yeah, there's nothing in the obstructing an underground road here. So, one down, there, up. the closest one I can get. Yeah, I will lose a little bit of uh, zoning by doing this, but it'll also ease traffic flow, so I think it's gonna be worth it. I also want that little footpath again. A lovely piece. It sort of reminds me of the time I was out by the lake enjoying the sun and the trees and I was in such a good mood that I pulled out my phone and listened to the very track we just heard. Delightful. What's that last one over there? Biodome. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, yeah, let's build one of those. And plop down some homes all around the biodome. right now it's pretty much residential that's in demand this is gonna be regular mill industry so I don't want to put homes too close to it but here seems fine and we have pipes right for the most part there are actually some pipes missing over here so let's fix that at least okay Services. Power, A-OK. -okay. Water, heating. That's fine. Garbage capacity, where it's actually pretty good at the moment. Death care is excellent. Health care, not so much. We could probably use another hospital. Especially since we're building this up to be uh, a significant population center. I'd like to build it on a side street though, or something like I can actually exploit. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, that seems actually that's fine. Let's build it here. Um, the reason I'm questioning that placement is because it's an avenue, so they can't immediately go out and across that way. But this is a major artery, so it'll be fine for the most part. If they need to go that way, they're gonna go around the roundabout over there. And they're also reasonably close to the highway. Yeah, that seems like a good placement for the hospital. Um, then there is the matter of fire protection. Well, we certainly ease the situation on the fire hazards. I mean, there's still a risk of a forest fire way out here. Or down here for that matter. But for the most part, things look good. Disaster prevention, on the other hand, we are way behind on. We could probably use quite a few radio masks, for example. Basically increase uh, our ability to protect our citizens. You're telling me there's no protection out there then. Is that for your red? I think it is, so we'll build one here. No, they're still red. Why are the ports still red? And of course you guys are also in the red. Um, there we go. I mean the large radio mast is way better, but it also is a bit clunky. Might build one up on the mountain. Just for show. And of course, shelter capacity, we have almost none of that. <laughs> I think we have two shelters, one small and one large. So we can't really hide people and we haven't built any escape routes. I'm not really concerned about that though. Uh, crime. Uh, no major issues there. Education, well. Primary school is now A OK. Same with education. And here you can see the population wave basically. All the young people have been educated now. So you have considerably less pressure for that. Now the pressure is on the universities, and soon enough they'll die and cause me a great deal of pain. Because that's what these dastardly citizens do. 
die and cause me pain. Yeah, again. Didn't I sort this all out? Thought I had. Okay, more of that here. Uh, not on that side. Here. On this side of the fire station, sure. Are they really complaining about the total number of workers, or are they complaining about the workers that can actually access them? I assume it's the latter. But I'm not sure anymore. Actually, no, because it's... Uh, oh, right. Um, it's an education thing, isn't it? Because our populace is so educated that uh, they don't find workers. Um, that's what's going on. And people are educating themselves out of uh, heavy industry. Uh, so we just might want to go with schools out. Can I see the actual stats on this? Uneducated 6%, educated 15%. Yeah, half the citizens half the citizenry is highly educated. I mean, having an educated populace is fine, but if we can't get our industries working, No, I'm wrong. It actually requires at least 15 educated workers. And there simply aren't the workers available. Okay, never mind. So even highly educated ones will actually work there. They'll just prefer to work in the offices and stuff. So we just need to increase the population. I think. Could be wrong. Population and of course the transit grid. I'm so tempted to just zone out this entire block <laughs> since I built it. But if I do that, we're, I'm so I'm setting myself up for a major death wave in the future, and that's why I'm trying to do basically stall this construction for a bit. Of course, the demand for residential areas keeps growing. Didn't I build this one? Oh. I forgot this one. Um, sorry folks, I know we just moved in here. But we kind of need to fix this road. So, sorry not sorry. And of course I need to blow up this one as well. Arry. B, there we go. B for boom. B for boom. Slope too steep, yes. There we go. And the same on the other side. It'll be easier there since this one is sloped in that direction. Now for the footy puppy. Footy path. And blow up all the homes, that's fine. Kaboom. And now we can zone. This is the problem of building when it's night time. I just don't see <laughs> see uh, what's actually there. No, I wish I could move this. Ah, that's fine. Let's keep it park here. 
uh, let's build some high residential, commercial, or high commercial density structures there. And we'll like underpass over here while I can still see it. And it is going to be an underpass, right? Yeah. Given that this road is basically on a hilltop. Probably the best idea, and unfortunately, unfortunately to get the best one, I need to delete that road. Need to get this road up again as soon as possible. Come on, there we go. Want that one extra square? Good, and of course the footpaths. Right now they won't do all that much, but once we get the uh, public transit systems going, we definitely need... We're gonna be glad we have these footpaths. Ease. Ease the burden or poor citizens. I think we're gonna have more industry on that corner. So, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. That's actually 8, so I didn't build this one in the center. Ooh. I was going to build one adjust it, but I could. Could have. Now this makes a good location for a park. Simply because we have open space there. Uh, maybe I want to build the special one, basketball court square. Here. Fine. Okay, I'm gonna take another short break, I think. And we'll see what we do next time. Thank you for watching.